I screwed my bike up, changing the oil. I stripped out the oil drain plug, and I'm gonna give you guys some confidence and let you know that it's all right, and we're gonna work through it right now. This is the stripped bolt. And uh, at the time it happened, I was considering recording the actual process, but to be honest with you, I could not, I was just too stressed out. I could not record it and try to focus on getting the footage while I was uh, focusing on not screwing up my bike because here I am drilling into the bottom of my brand new motorcycle. Get the bike up off the ground so that you have clearance to get a uh, drill uh, under the motorcycle. This is the bolt that I stripped out. And what I ended up doing was I went to my local Yamaha dealer and of course they don't even have the oil drain pan plugs in stock so I had to order it. So my bike was down for a little bit. Um, here's the part. I would recommend that, there's the part number. Recommend that you order this and get this on hand so that you know how deep you're gonna have to drill into this, okay? I know it sounds bad, but it isn't all that bad. So tools that you're gonna need to get the stripped oil drain plug out are gonna be a 90 degree drill. Do not use an impact driver on this. You need a drill, drill for uh, drilling. You're gonna need vice grips, that's for the extractor tool. The hammer is to set the extractor tool. Um, you're, I recommend getting um, left-handed drill bits do not use regular drill bits because what's that what that is doing is a regular right-hand drill bit turns to the right which is gonna tighten the bolt and that's the last thing that we want to do once you strip out that allen that hex insert on the drain plug so you want a left-hand drill bit now unless you have those on hand you're probably gonna have to order them i went to like four different um, hardware stores no one had left-handed drill bits so I stopped into Harbor Freight and lo and behold they have an extractor set that is I think $9.99 or something now I used the left-handed drill bits um, but I would not recommend using the extractor I, I can't speak for the extractor portion of this kit um, I had a set of Black & Deckers that I used so we'll go over the drill sizes. So this is a quarter inch. This is about the size of your actual Allen key insert that is located on your drain plug, okay? So I'm gonna recommend that you start off with a one quarter inch, right? When you get your new plug in, this is what you wanna do. You wanna take a, a measurement so that we don't go through and cause metal to go up into the bottom of the, the drain pan. We don't want that. So that's why I suggest getting the part so that you can measure. All right, throw a piece of tape on there. So you're gonna drill your one quarter inch hole up to your mark on the tape. And then you're gonna switch to the 1964. All right, 1964 bit. So we'll drill this up to the same mark. Put your piece of tape on here. Drill it up to the same mark, all right? Take the number five extractor, and what you're gonna do is insert it all the way up until it can't go anymore, and then you're gonna tap it. Give it a good tap with your hammer. Tap that. Well, I just almost set that, okay? And then you'll take your vice grips, you'll clamp on here, and, and make sure that you put even pressure when you're when you're turning this, use both hands, all right? And there's the bolt that, that's removed. I was so relieved when this broke loose. I thought I had screwed my bike up and I was like, oh, this is gonna suck. During prime riding season, it's a brand new bike and now my bike is gonna have to sit at the shop all for something stupid. Well, I hope uh, this helps. Uh, set your mind at ease and if you have any questions or comments feel free to list below
until next time, ride safe.